welcome to Early Fashion Talk Show. I'm your host, Brennan Stacker, and I'm always letting you know about the latest trends, especially here in the Windy City, Chicago. So today, we have two very special guests, fashion designer Gabrielle Zwick, who has joined us with co-founder Chris Mostello. Welcome, guys. Thanks for coming. Yeah, thanks so Thank much you. for having us. So, Gabby, you started, um, you've lived in Chicago for a little while, and you started designing in, in college. Where did the passion for fashion first first begin? Well, the passion actually started long before college. Um, I have been drawing and designing since I was very young, probably around like three years old. Um, the passion really sparked when I took a job at the local art center in my hometown. There I learned a lot about wearable art. I started making accessories out of just recycled goods and um, selling it at their gift shop. After that, I went to college for fashion design, and now I'm just trying to expand my brand and make my own women's ready-to-wear line. Awesome. And Chris, you guys have been friends for a while. Where did you first come into the picture? What, what do you bring to the, the company? Well, Gabby and I, we have really been friends for quite a while now. Um, we actually originally met without even knowing in an art summer camp um, quite a <laughs> while ago, uh, which is kind of an interesting story. But as she was saying, she went to school for fashion design and I went for fashion marketing, which is all the business and numbers, some of the boring stuff, but with the marketing, some of the fun stuff. Um, so we teamed up and created Gabrielle's Wick Designs. Perfect, awesome. So what type of audience does, uh, does Gabrielle Zwick Designs target? What type of fashion forward women, what can we expect? Well, um, since it's primarily a women's line, the, the silhouettes are very feminine. Um, I like to pull from the 1940s, a lot of pinup style, high-waisted. Um, so my ideal customer is usually someone who is fun, confident, um, flirtatious, but still a little bit conservative. Um, so really just someone who is fun and exciting and likes to express herself through fashion. Totally me. <laughs> <laughs> so I can't wait to see some of your samples because I know you have um, some models here to show off some of your clothes. So we're going to take a break, but if you're interested in checking out Gabrielle Zwick Designs, view her website at www.gabriellezwick.com. But don't change the channel because we're going to be right back after these short messages. <music> Welcome back guys to Early Fashion Talk. I am your host Brennan Stacker and today we are visited by our very special guest Gabrielle Zwick, a very talented fashion designer and co-founder of the company and friend Chris Mostello. So you were just about to show us some of your designs, some sample of your designs. L let's see, I'm so excited. Um, here Kylie, she is wearing a high-waisted purple short it has two style lines at the bottom in different colors. She also has a leotard in a stretch sheer, and it has it's color blocked and it has a metallic um, color there in the middle. So, and she also is wearing a pair of my earrings. They are vinyl and they're cut in a lightning bolt shape. Thank you, Kylie. <laughs> And here's Olivia. She is wearing a high-waisted pink skirt. It's a little bit longer in the back. And she is also wearing a leotard. It's of stretch lace, and it has color blocked with a seafoam green attached bandeau. She is also wearing some of my jewelry. There's, um, these are also some vinyl earrings. These are lace vinyl. They're cut into feathers. And then she has on one of my bracelets that is um, of recycled Barbie shoes. Thank you. <laughs> Love the recycled. And you're also wearing one of one of your designs. Yeah. I am actually, yeah. Oh, it's a fabric. <laughs> um, nice. This is actually an older one of mine. It's out of French denim and um, just has a couple ruffle details and um, Do a little really, spin, really so. crazy back. So <laughs> you can probably see. 
That's Thanks. so beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. So you recently went to New York. I did. Um, what kind of influence uh, did you influences did you get from there? What 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 can we expect from Gabrielle Zwick designs? Like, um, well, you're actually looking into the future here. The the styles that I brought with me are for next summer. Um, so you're going to be seeing a lot of bright colors. Uh, I want to do a lot more with accessories. Do some more elaborate accessories, more statement pieces, mm -hmm. and then um, I also want to do some hair accessories as well. Mm -hmm. So that's kind of the direction we'll go with that. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Totally excited, especially bright colors. Love it. Mm -hmm. So I, I obviously can't wait. But how can we? How can uh, folks at home and myself follow you guys? Well, you uh, can stay tuned with us on Facebook and Twitter as well. However, we are having some events around the city, local events, and um, you can stay up on those specifically at GabrielleZwick.com. Great. So I can't wait for you to open your own store because I'm coming shopping. <laughs> but and you need to come visit us again soon. Oh, we'd love to. Uh, <laughs> thanks everyone for watching Early Fashion Talk with us today. We'll be here tomorrow at the same time to talk about the latest styles. So thanks so much for watching. <laughs> and I. Thank you.